The Samsung Galaxy Tab S7 FE 5G is finally official. Samsung have finally introduced its newest member of the Galaxy Tab portfolio. The Galaxy Tab S7 FE brings fan-favorite features from the Galaxy Tab S7, including a large display for entertainment, creative work, and multitasking. Jumping into the specs, this one falls somewhere between the Tab S7 Plus which has 12.4-inch SMOLED 120Hz display and the Tab S7 with the 11-inch LCD 120Hz display. The Tab S7 FE has a 12.4-inch LCD with an impressive 2560x1600 pixel display, though it runs at only 60Hz. At least it comes with Android 11 with One UI 3.1 out of the box. Speaking of the box, inside you'll find an included S Pen, which you can use for note-taking and drawing. One UI also supports DeX mode. Anyway, the S7 FE is powered by the mid-range Snapdragon 750G chipset, instead of the 865 chipset of the other two slates. The base configuration is 4GB of RAM and 64GB storage, there's also a 6GB plus 128GB model. Either way, you can expand the storage with up to 1TB extra using the micro SD slot. Apart from this, the tablet has a 10,090 mAh battery and supports fast charging up to 45W. But, you only get a 15W adapter in the box. Anyway, the battery can endure 12 hours of web browsing over Wi-Fi or 4G, which is most likely less while using 5G. On the connectivity side, the tablet has 5G connectivity, Wi-Fi 5, Bluetooth 5.0 and GPS. There's a USB-C port, but no headphone jack, the tab does come with AKG stereo speakers with Dolby Atmos support. Now, talking about the cameras, the tablet has an 8-megapixel camera on the back with autofocus and 4K at 30fps video recording, and on the front is a 5-megapixel cam. The Samsung Galaxy Tab S7 FE 5G will be available in Europe from Samsung.com, below are the prices. So yeah, the new addition to the Samsung Galaxy Tab lineup, and also the FE lineup, Galaxy Tab S7 FE seems to be decent tablet with full S Pen and Samsung DeX support. What do you guys think about this tablet? Let me know in the comments section. Until then, see you guys later.